Hi everyone. I'm sitting over next to my window today so that I would have a clear shot to show you this little project I worked on yesterday. Um, and you remember back a couple of months ago when I made some colorful leaves from painted paper scraps? Well, I did have some left over and I still have some left over. I'll be using these leaves for a long time. <laughs> but um, I had seen on Pinterest a picture where a person had taken some branches from outside and glued paper leaves to them. I don't know what they used, if they used scrapbook papers or I just don't know. But they were beautiful and colorful and I saw that picture a long time ago actually and I never did anything with it. And then I made these leaves and I still didn't remember it. Well, I saw a photo again on Pinterest just the other day and I said, okay, I've got leaves. I'm going to go ahead and make one of those. So I made mine, of course, in a small size because I just love miniature small things like small books and journals and whatever. But I got this little milk jug um, on Amazon and um, that is available in my Amazon store if anybody's interested in this cute little vase. Um, it's uh, it's just adorable. So I, I picked some small limbs to uh, attach my leaves to. And I, I put a different color on the front and on the back of each of each leaf. And um, I just attached it by uh, gluing uh, two leaves together with a glue stick, uh, only I didn't glue it on one end. So I just glued it from the the bottom kind of going up but I, where you see I'm holding the uh, the leaf down with my finger. I didn't go past there with the glue. And I left it open on the end so that I could attach a glue dot. And, um, and then I just pinched it onto the end of the branch. Now I did have a tiny bit of problem um, until I started working a little more carefully. But with these tiny branches that I picked, they wanted to break easily, so I had to be really careful. Um, but this can be made in a larger size. You know, you can cut big leaves and you can use the bigger branches and a bigger vase and have the same effect only on a larger scale. I just had the most fun and it's such a simple project and the outcome like you see is just this colorful array of beautiful leaves and for such a simple project I just I love it and I did want to mention if you have a thicker uh, a branch you may need to do, use multiple glue dots depending on the size of your leaves and your branches so just keep that in mind when you're putting yours together and just enjoy it it's just really fun and simple and I love the outcome of it. Okay, so after I glued on uh, the leaves on this branch that uh, I just did in the video, I did three additional branches. Uh, these two are a little smaller, and this one was just a little bit larger. And I thought it would make a really cute arrangement, so all I did was just tucked 
these in the little vase. And I put this taller one in the middle so that it kind of, um, there we go, so that it has a, a good balance. And it's hard for you to see, I know on the uh, camera I've got a little bit close, but the middle one is just a bit taller than the others. But I really love this, you guys, and um, I hope that you do too, and uh, that you will take some of your scraps. Maybe you made some leaves back when I made mine. I'll include a link for that video uh, at the end of this video so that you can check it out if you haven't seen it. And um, for any of you who uh, maybe you're just beginning and in this mixed media world and you don't have a lot of uh, paper scraps, I have recently put a uh, set of my painted papers in my Etsy shop. So if anybody is interested in those, if you need some or you just want some, they're very colorful and pretty. And I will have a link to my Etsy store in the description of this video, as always. If you don't see it, make sure you click where it says See More and the description will open up further. And you'll be able to see all of my social media links at the bottom of the description box. So anyway, guys, thanks for hanging with me today while I... Um, made some pretty leaves and or I'm sorry I attached some pretty leaves out of just scraps of painted papers and made a pretty little home decor item I'll have this sitting in my art room I'm sure so all right take care everyone have a super day talk to you later bye-bye